Well, it may feel warm here in the metro area. As you just saw, it is a different story in the high country tonight. Fox 31 Samantha Spitz is in the pinpoint weather beast with a closer look at conditions for us. Sam. Yeah, pretty crazy. We went from the 70s just downtown to now about 20 degrees up here in the high country. Here's a live look outside on I-70 near the Eisenhower Tunnel. We're already starting to see that winter spring mix roll through with the snow and the high winds. Not a whole ton of visibility up here at night. And you can already see the snow sticking to the ground. So this later storm, really not what a lot of people were expecting up here after such a warm weekend. With the storm on the horizon, those heading up to the high country are leaving the warm weather behind. Um, I'm pretty cold. I'm pretty cold now, so I think that's why I'll have to keep this brief. You know, it's typical Colorado weather. That this day. latest spring snow catching some off guard. Yeah, we got caught in like an ice storm on the river when we were finishing, and it took us like two hours longer than we expected to get off. And then, you know, driving home, we just hit this snowstorm. While others. Yeah, we showed up with shorts and t-shirts today and we're just hoping for a sunset. The past couple days have been really beautiful blue, you know, hot, warm, sunny weather. And so we were kind of hoping for conditions like that. But just seeing the storm system move in, we were like, we'll see what we get. <laughs> Kyle Holman and his buddy Carter Winger are at Mayflower Gulch Trailhead making the best of the conditions. So I'm going to be on my split board and he's on his skis. Uh, so we're just going about a mile and a half up and just kind of stretching the legs, yeah, getting out there. In terms of my beacon working. The two come prepared for just about anything. We try to keep it conservative and safe for sure with what we ride. Shall we? Catching the last bit of daylight on the trail before more snow rolls in. I mean, April's the best time to be outside. You get a little bit of everything. Is it summer or winter? You'll never know. Yeah, back out here live snow is continuing to fall and will continue late into the night. There's lots of signage that we've seen along I-70 warning drivers of heavy snow and high winds the next few days. So, you know, while it might be nice in the lower elevations, we're not quite done with this snow just yet. Reporting live from the Pinpoint Weather Beast, Samantha Spitz, Fox 31. All right, Samantha, thank you for that update. And now would be a good time to download the Pinpoint Weather app so you don't get surprised by a spring snowstorm. You can get weather alerts sent right to your phone. The app is free for Apple and Android devices.